Isa Kita Mikeita aka Mika. Uh, unajua we unaweza tupata that's on white for for channel ama the Isa Kita on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. So right now I want to sample some of your requests and uh, your answers. As you remember our question for the day ni what useless thing did you learn in high school ama whichever school you went to be it uh, what's those are the schools the universities and the like. So let us know up. Brian and Asama Brian Kimtana Sama. I couldn't believe a female DJ could make my day like this. Big up oh. DJ Lil Russian. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, Brian, I can't be a easy DM. Is it a cast of lead? Is it a slide? So, so I became see and Asama tuned from Facebook. Uh, Janie Gitahi, uh, she has the same name as me. Hmm. Maybe we're related. I don't know. Asama, find X in mathematics. It really wasted my time. Wow. I never found X. Who's it? I don't know if we, the camera people, anyone has ever found X? No one has ever, have you ever found X? X where? No, we've never found X. Where is X? I don't know where X no, is. Hmm? We're still looking for X, yeah. <laughs> apparently. Mm -hmm. um, Breezy Tomilin, and some uh, logarithms. Me attend the there's such a word, by the way. Logarithms came the whole of it. Akina Kishanzi Huru. What is Kishanzi Huru, AC Gracie? I have no idea. <laughs> I have no what, clue what, what that is. is. I think it's part of Kiswahili. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it's Kiswahili, definitely. It's not French. But to judge you, I know what context Kishanzi. Adi Kimse Ameruditana na sama nicheze tetema na kondani. Tetema. I think that's directed to DJ Lil Russian. So, tamcheze tetema wa maisha cheza? Bado. Bado. Coming through, yeah. Ina kamu. Uh, Nyasimi Petero Nsomoka, hmm, Facebook names na kwambia. And it's about being my first time to watch the program, I'm glad. And I regret I've missed what I, and I, I regret uh, that I've missed so far. Hmm, that's nice, that's nice. Uh, every 8 to 12, on the Tupata, up on Y254 channel, we're on this TV as well, channel uh, 376. On Twitter, mtu anasema, ii handle yake ni at Joshua Mwega. Five and I'm tuning live from Webuye. Mm, okay. Um, again, I'm Hagai Kimonge. Good morning, White Five Four Channel. Tuned in from Mombasa County. What are Mombasa representing? So, Nataka Tuanze, our first interview with AC Gracie. Yeah. Welcome. Thank you for you're having me. You're not new to the scene. No. <laughs> you're not new to White Five Four Channel, although no. you're new to Isa Kids. Yeah, I guess so, yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So welcome. Pleasure being here. Your story, Ilianza Vizuri Sana, uh, in the music industry, uh, you like uh, you liked to do covers on fa uh, uh -huh. on Facebook and uh, YouTube, YouTube as well. Yes, yes. Then you got the att attention of someone in particular, Pascal Tokodi. Yeah. And I believe there was like a cash prize involved. Uh -huh. Can yeah. you tell us the story? So um, in 2016, I Pascal Tokodi tracked a song called Sitaki. So the idea was he said. Uh, Someone, people should do covers of the song, mm. and then the best cover gets 50,000, mm. plus you get to do the acoustic version of the same song with him. Mm. So I just tried it out and... Were you nervous when you won? Because you, uh, you were like, huh, now I have to do this cover with this guy. Ah, so, so I see, I see. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's exciting, because uh. that's like, my music is everything to me. Yeah. I, I wasn't... I wasn't nervous because that initially I just did it because my friends were in Chocha. Mm. I wasn't like doing the cover at here, have to win. It's because I was actually in the studio. Mm. Then someone called me and they're like, hey, you guy, could this thing uh, about the song? Yeah, so uh, considering like the fact that I was in the studio already, so I just wrote the lyrics. And I told my guys because we were with the band, we're like, hey, let's just do this mm. to a post. So, and I made it coming. Mm. Yeah. But after that, you just blew up, you were everywhere. Yeah, after that, I think season I decided to just go solo because I wasn't really taking music that serious. Mm. So after that, you know, eh, I was like, Kumbe, there's something What do you mean here. by that? Uh, what do you mean by you uh, weren't taking music seriously? You were in the studio at the time. Yeah, I was, but yeah. I think I was just doing it as a hobby because I was hobby. also in school. So, so uh, I was just doing it like passing time, free time. I, I never really thought about it as a business, something you can actually brand yourself. Mm. So after the cover, I was mm. like, mm, if I can actually get money out of this man. Yeah. Did you feel <laughs> like uh, it. it was more pressure than a calling? Because once uh, we find your cover, people are now expecting something else from you. It's something that AC, actually fun fact, uh, we'll get uh, to this uh, mm -hmm. later on. You're no longer AC Gracie, you're now officially yeah, AC. AC. No, it's okay, it's AC. It's just AC. But yeah, I, I just wrote it as officially AC cause 
on Instagram. There are so many aces. So that <laughs> <laughs> I had to find something that has AC on it. Uh. So I couldn't use official AC or anything. So I Okay, I we're going to find out why AC. you had to, yeah. you know, remove the gray seat. Yeah. But uh, did you feel more pressure to uh, release something? I have never felt pressure, to uh. be honest. I um, For me, music, any music is my my happy place. Mm. So I do not... Anything that's not like does, that does not make me comfortable. I just don't like. I don't take it to where music is. So maybe any. I was just doing things the way I do. That. I I never feel pressure. Mm. I refuse to feel pressure because I feel like pressure will just make you do things sometimes you don't want to do. You'll release songs you don't even want to release. So yeah, I'm just doing me. You're just doing you. Yeah. I want to sign this check. Yes, uh. definitely, but yes, they are signing Beatrix, mm. at least you only do Kitambo, so... Actually, I'm asking you because I noticed uh, when I was looking at your videos online, so most of them, actually some of them, just some of them, they are on uh, Urban Scotch's account? Yeah, so um, I wouldn't call it being signed, uh. but um, that's why I was recording, and like, uh, I just didn't have experience, I didn't, I didn't know what I was doing sana, compared to now, because... Music, uh, music. I think is just like any other job. You need time to learn and understand what you're so doing. So he's, he's like your mentor. Yes, he's my producer. He's my, I call him Pops. <laughs> he's my you dad. Call him I call, Pops. Yeah. Okay. So uh, at that point, it was easy for him to do these things for me because he was like doing most, if not everything. So me, I was just recording, and then he does everything. But as a say, at least I've been learning. So yeah, I can do most of these things on my own. Mm. What do you think is the biggest challenge uh, to break out in the music industry? Uh, well, uh, um, well, get, I think getting, usually getting airplay or that um, attention mm. is a problem because people have good content, but having someone who can get that content out there to the right people mm. is usually the biggest problem. Jew. And it, it's not easy. It's like not kuna, easy. Kuna I'm sure so easy. I mean, Ata kufika hapa is like to them it's a and they're wondering Sasa, how do i get on exactly. inside exactly mm. it's, it's so hard because people have content actually you use money you make a video you do an amazing audio like in you have it then you're like Sasa, what next mm. so usually that's the problem because if when once you're out there yeah that's it mm. but uh with urban scotch he taught you the ropes so he showed you how to did you teach you marketing because i hear that's the biggest problem yes exactly marketing. because people mm. are, have to resort to you know clout chasing Instead of actual marketing for the music. Well, he didn't. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm glad he, he kind of taught right. me. Uh, I'm glad that there's no there's no story about you somewhere in the tabloids. Mm -hmm. I'm glad about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll yeah, keep yeah. it that way. Yeah. <laughs> so, keep it um, that yeah. Um, I could say he taught me yes, not not everything, but he. Let's just say he tries his best. Mm. Like we're not. I wouldn't say that he's at a position where he can do. He can make you know magic like this, mm. like um, the big artists maybe we have. But the kidogo he can do, he's done. And yes, yes. shout out to so many other people. Like, um, mother, I have people supporting me when you sometimes jury because sometimes I get interviews from people I don't know. Yeah. Like, they just call you for yeah, the interview. Someone just uses your song and they DM you and they tell you is how to hook up now. Can you interview me? Exactly. So, mm. maybe it's yeah. the way you write your music. Actually, that's something I needed to ask you. Uh, with one in particular, Renzo, I need to speak for the boy child now. Nime kutoke. Ilikuwe nika unatubashi na we. Was it a personal experience? Uh, yeah, nime kutoke was very, very. <laughs> Who's this guy? Uh, <laughs> a boy child. I have no <laughs> idea where he is now. <laughs> <laughs> I wrote that on Kitambo. It's uh -huh. just, um, I recorded it in 2017, but I wrote it way back. It was, mm. it was just a sad story, but... Mm. Got over it. You got over it. Yeah, I'm fine. I now. hope so. Because you are another one that could bash. We're good people. Uh, yeah, We're good right. people that bash an archery. Yeah, we are. Wait, we are. I mean, know. We are like, yeah, I know. I'm I'm like, like, we are good. <laughs> Speak uh, for yourself. So, so, uh, me, boy child, a good person. Boy child, this is what we're But then there's there's <laughs> one. Me and my producer were actually bumping to this one uh, before we started. Mm -hmm. Of course, there's a new one, Sugar, yeah. aka Mdogo Mdogo. Uh -huh. But uh, this came. Uh, can you tell us about that? It was, you know, uh -huh. kind of raunchy. Uh -huh. So uh, this game. And it was a little bit different from the regular AC. Uh -huh. So uh, this game was a song I wrote. Mm. Um, when I was I was talking to my girlfriends, so we realized all of us are complaining about things you guys do. 
<laughs> no, no. You guys. Who is this person? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. It's not. It wasn't even Chama. about me, really. It's mm. just I realized, like we, we realized, every time we link up, people are complaining. CJ, my guy has done what? CJ, my guy has done what? Hey, that's how we're here wondering, Kwani. Madam, you pick it. Let me see. Pick it. Don't touch it. So, why are we the ones who keep crying about CJ? Mm. Ah, so after that, I just went in. And wrote um because the song talks about ukini chesa na kucheza like yeah. so we were talking about if we decided to play the game you guys play mm. we'd probably do it way better it's just because mm. we choose to Lay keep low. it on the low yeah mm. <laughs> like in the PRC mm. to know me so because the mm. Russian when I can play I tell you ah, <laughs> what wow. I'm wow. so nice actually I'm really <laughs> I'm here just playing music. They all say that. Good. No, 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 no. Until proven guilty. Until proven guilty. Until proven guilty. But for now, that is unseen. Let us see you are becoming oppressed. Yeah. But let me ask you this. In terms of your music, is that the direction? Is it more empowerment? Or... Uh, um, I wouldn't say that. Yeah. Um, for me, music is an outlet. Yes, it's like it's an expression. It's how you wake up in the morning and just look at the sun and think, "Wow, you know, the weather is amazing." I like. I wouldn't even want to put myself in a box. That's why when people ask me, "I said you about the genre of music," said you mm. what? I do not want to say like. I, I'm still I feel like I'm still trying to figure myself out mm. and then there are so many things to talk about you know so so many I, things to sing about so many things yeah. Yeah. so I, I, I usually don't want to CG I don't want to put myself in like a box yeah. maybe I'll sing about I think things that are people wouldn't expect me to sing about mm. yeah which is like uh, now uh, from this game to sugar it was like almost totally different and I like that you're not uh, being defined by a genre yeah. before we talk about sugar you're a vocalist, you're not just an artist. So I want to give the people back at home a nice treat. Just, <coughs> you know, you know well, I'm going with this, uh, yeah? <laughs> a treat to Kidogo to uh, Any song? Yeah, camera number four. Uh, I'm gonna sing this game. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five. You think you can play, baby, so can I. One, two, three, four, five. You think you can share, baby, so can I. You can play this game, yeah. Oh, to to play this game, yeah. It's enough for a treat, I guess. Hey, na kuambi, kali, kali, kali. Thank you. So to, and you weren't taking music seriously. That's what you're telling me. What? No, I was not. For some weird reason. Uh. This is just funny. Amma, I used you to think. You could just say. No, that's uh. the funny part. I thought in my in my mind, everyone everyone could sing. Mm. <laughs> so if so, someone told me that you can sing, I'm like, thanks, you too. Amma, hmm. mm. like I, I I never really, by the way, I never thought of music as a talent, atia, a skill, atia, or like at I was good. Because mm. if someone told me that, I'd go like, mono na nichiongo amse. You know, yeah, I'm like, are you sure? I'm gonna, are you, you're just telling me something nice to make me feel nice, or what's going on? Mm. Yeah, eh, awesome. Mm. Now, Sugar, Dogum Dogo, can you tell us the inspiration between be, uh, behind the song? Man, Sugar is a love song. Mm. I think people are like, who didn't want to sing my song? Sad, sad, up, like you said, bashing. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so, I decided, let me just check. Uh, a love song, man. So it's it's uh, it's just a song. Does to a this guy. mean now there's a uh, a new person in your life now treating you the way you're supposed to yes. be treated. Yes, by all means. <laughs> do tell, do tell, do, do tell. tell. Just feel. Good <laughs> 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 This is our area. Here for this. <laughs> Give us the key. Wow, mm. there, there's really no, okay. There's, there's nothing much to say. Mm. Yeah, but there's someone. There's someone a John Ona. Near and dear. Yeah, yeah very mm. man, absolutely. So, uh, so we're expecting like uh, nothing but love songs now. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. Apana, I think ah, can give any bomb tabueka. Ah, tabueka. That's kind of mimi man. Uh. Like I, I want to like I'll be checking things that are just unpredictable. But definitely love songs. Do me realize this is sad songs, pia man. Mm. Taki kwa depressed. <laughs> mm. They're taking you somewhere yeah. else where you don't want yeah, to go. Yeah, but maybe emotions are everything, man. Because I, I. It fuels your music. I I I, so I I think I read somewhere mm. that people express heartbreaks more than they express 
like better than how they'd express love you know if someone tells you they hate you it's you'd feel it more than if they told you they love you mm. for real because if, if someone sang about they love you like, mm, oh. but if someone wrote a full song mm. about how you piss them off mm. you just be like where can you really find that nini so that's uh, the main direction i, I don't want to say anything like i don't have a main direction <laughs> Seriously. You're open to anything Any at this and point. And everything, yes. Uh, mm. But I like uh, that you, you write your own songs and they're fueled by your personal experiences. I think yes. that's a rare thing. Yeah, and because it's you need easier. to keep doing it, yeah. Kabisa. That's very awesome. Mm. We're about to play uh, Sugar, aka Mdogo Mdogo, by officially AC or AC. I'm yeah. AC Gracie Kwa, or my fans are like us. It's just AC. I'll just AC. AC. <laughs> Which one you can be from Kenya, just AC, at Africa, just no, AC, on, on, on just is the first name. So. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> on Instagram, it's yes, it's at officially AC. Yeah. Also on YouTube, but I'm not using that as my my name. My name is just AC. Just AC. But because you can't, uh, on, like the social media handles, kuna time they can't like you can't even sometimes you can't use aka one word. Mm. They tell you too short or all those things. That's why I'm using at officially AC. Mm. But I'm just AC. Yes. Sasa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, well, uh, obviously, we share some of my kupata officially AC everywhere. So make sure you go and subscribe and subscribe yeah. and subscribe. But there's a question I needed to ask uh -huh. you. Uh, to make a watu. Uh, all the summer, you look useless in high school. Sorry? Uh, what subject did you say was useless in high school? Mathematics. Mathematics. Subjects, yeah. Not, not just subjects. Just subjects. Uh, like what thing <laughs> did you learn what? and it's useless to your life right now? Personally, mm. um, this thing used to make cocoa and blue band and... Mkorogo? Yes. Mkorogo was not useless. No, now. That thing on Kowadvi. No, now. Uh. It's, now it's useless because why would you useless. make that at home now? Like, <laughs> you, why would you just take blue band and cocoa? Ah, yeah, see, those are survival skills in no. a You never know. There could be an apocalypse and you're rationing your stuff. So now. you make a oh, Mkorogo. Oh, there, there was movies. that one. There was that Mkorogo <laughs> and there was the other one uh, uh, hmm? with the Roiko. Yeah, Roiko. You can yeah. get uh, some Roiko, Vitungu and all that. You, you remember that? Mm -mm, I didn't do that. You never did that? No. I learned a group of schools. Right? Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, you need to survive. No, 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 no. You need to survive. Uh, well, I'll, I'll tell you after the show. I'll explain <laughs> it. I'll give you the ingredients. <laughs> Guys, back at home, we're still asking that question. Uh, what useless thing did you learn back in high school or even college and you're not really using it right now?